Well, but we just got done putting some plastic bonder over on my other Sawzall over there, letting it set up. I took apart a Ryobi detail sander that had paint all over the casing and cleaned it off to get the paint off the casing. I'm redoing this block plane right here, which is looking pretty good. Just need some spray paint. I ordered some heavy duty spray paint to redo that with. And then I have this one block plane here, which is covered in rust. And I was soaking some stuff in vinegar, but it takes a long time and it doesn't work nearly as well as evapor rust. So I think I'm gonna have to go get some evapor rust to put that in. So that's what I'm working on here. I'm gonna go ahead and try to put together this Ryobi detail sander. There's some other issues with it and see if I can't get it going. So we got the Ryobi back together here, cleaned it up, looks a lot better, put some grease in there. There's basically a motor inside here, has a little fan on it right around here. And just a shaft that goes into a little ball that sits into a little cradle. Like you have a ball and then there's a cradle around it. And when the motor spins, it vibrates, vibrates to the end of it here and down just like this. But the bottom of this thing is like an old system that Ryobi used, I guess, and got some sticky sandpaper. So I'm gonna try to adapt one of these multi-tool hook and loop so that we can use any multi-tool paper and it'll work fine with that thing. So that's the idea there. Just gotta cut this off right here and then put these two together because they are about the same size and it should look rather normal and hopefully work better than before. So I put the oscillating tool piece and the top piece from the Ryobi together with epoxy. It's raining. I went in to go pick up my auction goods at a local auction and I really enjoyed this one. You can just tell there's Makita colors down there. There's a DeWalt saw, some hand saws, some classic toolboxes underneath that. Got some cool ground spikes, some awesome nails that are about foot long. In the back, there's a foldable cart like you take to the soccer game for your kids. There's a Roby box with a Roby combo set in it and some more stuff we'll get into later.